Crepo. Speaker of the crowd. First of his name. First of his name. <laughs> All right, inhibitor is closing in. Look at Sven. Right. So, actually analyzing these team fights is very hard because the power shifts are tremendous, and the power of revive here is such a big influencer. But Sven can play with absolute liberty because Mithy's shields are massive. There's Mikael's. There's Locket. There's so many items catered to keep Sven alive, and he's charging it. going in, he gets the knockup, but he's going to get burned down. Will he respond in time? Chaos Storm, can they get it off? They're continuing to push forward. Defiance comes out, they're backing off. So is so the Nexus. Expect, he has to turn Mega. He has to stop this immediately. They need the double bomb. There, are they going to be able to get it? I don't know. They push forward. We've seen so That's many turn. Oh, OG! One final move, so as with the hero play to close out that 67-minute game. <laughs> Zaytun Otan güzel bir büyük halkanı ama şimdi büyük halkanı bekleme süresine girdi. Bunu kullanacak mı Beşiktaş? Hayır. Şu anda yapılacak bir hatanın nelere mal olacağını çok iyi biliyorlar. Hata yapma lüksü olan takım Dark Passage. O rahatlığı olan takım Dark Passage bu arada seken atışla beraber Robin'i bu hale getirmeyi başardılar. Bu arada kimsenin şu anda hata yapma lüksü yok. Dark Passage'in de? Ha, Dark şey, Passage'in seride ha, evet, ha, maç. hala iki maçlık üstünlüğü devam doğru, ediyor. Yani doğru. her ne kadar bu karşılaşma her şeyin ortada olduğunu şimdi gösterse de... Şimdi yalnız 5. ejder çıkacak tekrar. Tabii Dark Passage adına 5. ejder... Beşiktaş adına dördüncü. Burada savaşacaklar. Bu arada meydanda ayağı yükü geldi. Ulti de geldi. Yine sadece Arfan'a tuttu. Arfan'a arkada. Yine güzel Abar. bir Nautilus ultisiyle Ruvelius'u savaştan çıkardılar. Zayra Avarya'yı yakalayabilecek mi? Kışkırtmayı başardı. Yukarıdan yamacın üstünden Ruvelli ile Immortor'u vurmaya devam ediyor. Şimdi Crystal'ı yakalayacaklar. Crystal düşecek mi? Crystal orada Zonyas'ını kullandı. Örümcek inişini kullandı. Müthiş zaman kazandı ama yeterli olmayacak. Crystal'ı düşüyor gibi Crystal görünüyor. Düşecek. Bu sefer Düştü. Bu sefer bitti. 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 Dörde bir nasıl? Yani Her gidiyor. Birinin elini Her gidiyor sefer. ama üç tane inhibitör var. Üç tane yani. inhibitör. Önce inhibitörü alması lazım. Yok hiç bitti oyun. Ardından inhibitör aldıktan sonra Hibiki'yi de geri yolladılar. Evet. Bu bu minyonlar oldukça önemliydi. Zırhını azaltmak isterlerdi muhtemelen ama. Orta koridorda Elvin henüz inhibitörü bile almayı başarmadı. Diğer saldırı gücü şampiyonu da geliyor. Immortor da oraya yaklaşıyor. 69-70 dakika. Bu arada Elvin geri geldi. Birini duvara yaslamak isteyecektir ama Zayraz orada hemen onu kışkırtıyor. Elvin tehdidini de ortadan kaldırdılar. Ruvelius ilk defa çok agresif bir sıçra atmadı. Nexus'u yıkmak üzere bir oyun yapıyor. 69 dakika, 24 saniye, 715 milyon, Ruvelius milyon Doğru. rekoru. A princípio, mas a qualquer momento eles vão para cima do Alex Kidd, vão para cima do Mizuki. Qualquer um que bobear ali, que seja um alvo prioritário. Olha o Fini, deu muito dano para cima do Alex Kidd. Dá aquela espantada, barra incendiária para Passou no meio de todo mundo. É jogado pro alto o jogador Shine. Todo mundo foca nele. Ele ainda tá vivo. O Sheldon é que tá danificado. Caiu o Alex Kidd. E veio o rolo compressor do time da Genesis. Passando por cima da galera da INTZ. Agora, meu amigo. Agora acabou. O Riva é eliminado. Mas nada mais importa. É GG. Vitória do time da Genesis. Is the focus for now, but a good trap line. Can't understate the value of those traps at this stage in the game. Good hit from Sneaky. Instantly healed up already by NL, and the tower will fall shortly. Sneaky can't be in two places at once, though, and there's super minions on his Nexus turret, so that turret falls, and maybe even more. Impact should be able to get Sword Art, not just yet. Very good defensive act for Prison. Equalizer is out. Inhibitor falls. All three are down. Double supers spawning. Three seconds for Meteos to come up. Sword on the shockwave for a support. Chain of corruption goes out. There's no equalizer. There's there the is oh, oh, he's, back. he's looking for a target. He stuns up Maple. That's the shutdown. But somebody has to defend supers. NL's running for his life. Meteos is looking for all. MFD is down. 75 second death timers. NL looking for Meteos. Passes come into support. Meteos forced to deal potential away. here. Although the rest of C9. They've come to contest as well. It would be very risky for Flash Wolves to try to go for that seal because if these guys die, they could just snowball this into a push. Shockwave not going to get caught as NL is able to channel the arcane ship. True shot barrage, not secured. Also, the challenge is massive. Coming back from three inhibitors is incredibly rare, but they have a lot of the recipes to do it. If you just want to commit to this, will he be here in time? The Baron is going down very Does quickly. Try another steal. Oh, this, this will risky. be so risky. Flash Wolves hesitating. Impact is here now. Do Cloud9 go for it? Medios is in the pit. pit. Medios is behind Baron. Gets caught. The shot wave. It's secured by Jensen. But who wins the fight? Equalizer on him. Comes down. Smoothie's in trouble. Gets the shield. Doesn't survive the piercing arrow. Impact is running for his life. Flash is available shortly, as is the slicing maelstrom. Baron 4, Cloud 9!
already has the turret down. But maybe this is a strategy to try and get all of the outers down. Sneaky, with every rapid fire shot, takes a good chunk of that turret down. Yeah, the tower should fall. Flash rolls. They use the tidal wave. They're they use the caught. equalizer. Sidestep away. Sneaky stays alive. MMD goes gold with the outer block. Here comes he impact. Cancels it. He cancels it. Impact's going to come in the video. Oh, They've got they it. Got they it. killed him. That's it. it. They have just done it. They jump out to Corsa. It's a five on three. Mitos is running for his life. Cocoon goes out. Enel's looking for impact. The super minions will now start pouring through. Baron and Elder and everything is with Cloud9. At the very least, it's two inhibitors, but it could very well be the game if they proceed properly. Look They're at Enel. He has to do the work. There's hundreds of minions in the base. Enel is chunked up. One He's turn running out. for his life. The Nexus turret goes down. The Nexus turret number two is killed. And Cloud9, they don't give up. They don't surrender. And they take down Flash Wolves. Cloud9 coming in here. That's going to be Coco and Flame jumping in. Kramer gets popped out immediately. And it looks like he might go down the lambs despite the only thing keeping him alive. He gets knocked out of that and he falls. Chaser finds the kill. Now the curtain call coming out. Can they find the primary targets? PDD in the back line. It's not going to happen. CJ trying to kite and kill as many as they possibly can. But the Guardian Angels are still there to keep him alive. PDD goes down. That's going to be bad life falling as well. It's just bubbling. And Udara bubbling, having to run for the hills. Udara with a very big shield. It's only going to do so much. He goes goes down. It's a four in the end of this. It's going to be a four for zero for Longju. And they can just win the game right off of this fight. Utara, good lord. Won't die. So they send the Jin now into that mid lane. Bubba's going to try for an epic backdoor. Are you ready? I don't think be he can. Be the hero. I, he's got to try. It's the only thing he can do. He's jumping well, out. They, they know he's there. They have 30 seconds. They have 30 seconds. They're gonna lose this inhibitor. Can Longju close? Untara lived for a really long time. Well, Flame is going to answer bubbling in this bottom lane. Coco's not quite there, but that's gonna be one tower going down and the inhibitor in this mid lane. Longju looking like they're gonna be able to finish this off. Bubbling trying to duel against Flame, but he's just too big on the poppy. Kramer getting ready to come up, but the towers are already being knocked down. What is going on? I don't know, this is uh... This one. is like, yep. Yeah. Two, <laughs> bubbling falls. Kramer's here, can't do anything. He says, stay in that fountain. Knocks him back, and uh, that's gonna be <laughs> the next is falling. Good lord, we're going to game three. Logs you actually. Just hit. Look at those minions hammering away on the inhibitor. Top lane is under pressure as well. Qvay's looking to break open the top. Ambition and Ruler, they break open the bottom. Pressure now moving. The mage core JJ. On that full build Zyra, now putting pressure on the middle inhibitor. Up top is that that's all three. three. That's three. Here we go, SKT last stand. Samsung Galaxy and SKT have had the longest game at World 2016. And the world might be stunned if Samsung can close this out. They're on the pressure. The Nexus turrets are being focused, and there's so many minions. Three inhibitors down, double stacked up, super minions empowered by the Baron buff. This is the onslaught, Samsung, we're waiting to pull off! Duke's in trouble, he gets kicked the wrong way though. Crown throws out the voice of light, bang is down, then forced away. He's onto the fountain to regen. The first Nexus turret is down. I asked if you believe, Staples, you got behind Samsung. They're now in the final fight. Strength of Thorns buys down, Crown's oh, in trouble, oh, but it's Duke that gets killed. Ruler, Arkane shifts forward once again, so aggressive. They're so low. Away. Crown barely lives, and he's gonna have to go back to base the heal after that one. But then the going to build without him. It's not over. The Nexus. the Nexus is down. Samsung stunned the world and defeat SKT for their first game in finals. Somar para a equipe. Só o poke do Ezio não está sendo suficiente muitas das vezes. Então a Aquino também segura bem. A resposta dele deles para salvar o Escabaixo ali foi rápida. E agora sim. Voltou o dragão, Tobo. Voltou o dragão. Ah, já coração. Já tem Skybart, inclusive, com teleporte na base. Vamos ver como é que vai ser a aproximação dele. Dragão sendo feito, por enquanto, apenas pelo PBO. Vem se aproximando do teleporte. O Alt vai tentar pará-lo. 2 mil de vida. A luta iniciada. Foco justamente nos atiradores do time da CLB. Na bom pode ser o primeiro a cair. Eliminado pelo João. Yoda com linda translocação pela parede. Tem agora o capel. Vai tentar ir pra cima do Yoda. Que Goku, o Aoshi vai pra cima, mas não consegue fazer nada. Vai ser o terceiro abate. Double kill, 
Toboku! E que combo daqui no Toboku, jogaram bem demais com o ultimate do Brown, mais da MF, o Teus me encaixando muito dano nessa luta. PBO vivo quer levar a rota inferior, mas será que não perderam o jogo por causa dessa luta, CNB? A gente vai descobrir nos próximos minutos ou não, mas enquanto isso, o Super Minions entra em levações do Nexus, PBO e também o Oz vão tentar levar o jogo, porém já tem dois jogadores da equipe da Kine, então consegue segurar a pressão, será que o jogo vai acabar? 73 minutos de partida, olha o dano do PBO, foi sensacional, Skybart ainda tenta sair vivo, vamos ver se ele consegue, foco em cima do PBO, meu Deus do céu, que jogo é esse? Eliminado o Skybart, mas vai acabar, Operation Kindo vence a partida! In 75 minutos. And that was certainly more than a war of attrition. It took them so many different mini ways, backing up smartly. This is Eva finally looking for an aggressive pick. This is something that Bless hasn't been able to do. He failed the first couple for a long, long time. The first kill in at least 30 minutes of play took forever onto Soul, but eventually died quickly after he respawned, forced everyone away. Eva don't get anything extra out of that kill. The death time is starting. There's still 40 seconds till Soul's alive. <laughs> we so saw him die, we saw play, we saw a replay, and there's still 40 seconds. And a recall, and a rejoin into this mid lane. And an enabler going down, so now they got two in 75 minutes. It's about 76 minutes. And this Lots looks like this might be the final push here. Do or die time for Spenu. Hit the turret! Nuclear just gonna fall. Temp just finishing him off. Turret's still not taking a hell of a lot of damage, though. Crazy. You know he's not taking a lot of damage, crazy. Yeah, he's not taking very much, but first turn goes down, looks like the second one is going to be able to follow suit here. Well, it's because Guardian Angel pop finally, that's going to be the inhibitor going down at 76 minutes. Game one ends. Right, Feather, Vin, and Reckless, they're in a race to set the CS record, but it may be the highest CS in a lost game. That's not something Fnatic want. Setting up for a potential bush, a yellow star looking for the Aqua Prison bubble. Yeah, tension's coming back into the game. For a play here. Oh, Any look at Spirit. Age He's spirit. going in. Power of Evil's caught out. Emperor's Defight followed by Flash. A lot of damage under Spirit. Gumsu's running away from Soas. Soas is able to pick up an advantage in that situation. This is good for Origin here because both uh, Feven's Flash and Spirit's aggressive move there were being used here. So the counter engage is out of Fnatic's hands right now. Yes, Power of Evil's a little low. But he's basing and he will teleport in, but Spirit is here again and Power Reveal is in base. This is gonna be close, no flash for Power Reveal back there. Here. Bottom of your screen, Power Reveal is teleporting in and they're looking to just go for the Nexus! They're going for the Nexus, it's gonna die so quickly! Origin, they, they got an expecter to take down Fnatic! Power这边的话也是尽量的强效,消耗到卢西安的一个血量。就是巴德这里的话是出了一个,嗯,出了一个传送门。现在想要尽一点微薄之力然后再拿一个打龙buff 
进到了对方老龙，西安就是被鸟吗？小狗走掉了。直接是一套射门起点扫回来的话，这个动画加点脚出金身,身，但还是要死。哇，艾克在偷了，这边进回来能不能守得住？守不住，怎么可能守得住？闪现过来，我们可以恭喜一下 RBG 成功的拿下了这局比赛，旷日持久的打到了。